Wish I was above the center of attention, but I'm not. I wish I didn't have to give in to the pressure. Uh oh. I'm posting pictures, trying to be someone I'm not. It feels just like I'm lying to you. I fake it, stage it, trying to live some perfect life. I know I'm wasting time. Cause I just wanna call my friends. Well, happy Monday, we are back to we vlogging. Are back at it. Back on the road. <laughs> Man, it was nice having a week <clears throat> off. Well, we got everything done. I was gonna say, I say a week off, but we really had stuff we were doing almost every day except for like the last three days home. Let me shut the truck off real quick. We're in uh, Baytown, Texas right now. We're in the line at the Blue Beacon here. Gonna get a truck wash. Yes, finally. She needs it. Yeah. She's not terribly filthy, but no. bugs and all that stuff. It's time for a wash. Yeah, she needs it. Where did we leave off at? We left off at, we were in Virginia. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We were and in And we Virginia. were waiting for a load. Then all of a sudden, just out of the whim, we said, screw it, let's go home. Yes. Let's go ahead and get all the stuff we need to get done. Yeah, so and we did deadhead home. I mean, it was, what, 1,700 miles? Yeah, about 1,700 miles to get home. Which y'all are probably like, oh, my gosh, you deadheaded that far. But honestly, fuel is cheap right now. It is cheap. And yeah. we needed to get this stuff done. It was stuff that has to be done. Yeah. Like, yeah. It, if I didn't get my med cert done, yeah. they would suspend my license. And I know yeah. they got extensions and all that for that stuff. But Texas is open for business. So Yeah, yeah. So we were able to get that done. Yeah. We got our, we had to get our, this truck registration done. Uh, we had to take the babies in for their yearly checkups. Yep. Um, just a bunch of odds and ends stuff that, yeah, we needed to get done. We got all, everything we needed done and we had a couple days to relax got mama crafty her new tv we got her her new tv yeah. big old 65 inch yeah, samsung she's loving it 4k smart doing, tv yes yeah, scully's doing good yep, i yep. think he's actually getting more calm now i can't believe I that it's so. been do you know it's been two years since we found him yeah he's getting calmer he ain't biting me no more yeah yeah he's, he's... actually letting me pet him and he's like <laughs> rubbing up against yeah. me and i'm like wow okay. yeah crazy right yeah so the last two days we stayed uh in the truck at an rv park there in uh, Waco. The Airstream is still at the Airstream dealer. We didn't stay in that, but one night while home, because we had to take it in, there was a recall on the spare tire holder, and then we had just a couple small warranty, warranty stuff. stuff that needed yeah. fixed. And We wanted to stay in that, but we had to stay in the truck while we were at home. Yeah. So, I uh, mean, we could have went and stayed at uh, Mama Crafty's, yeah. but... Yeah, we let her have her space and yeah, we have ours. And... Yeah, we don't mind staying in the truck, especially with those biggest sleeper yeah, we yeah, got yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. When you go to sleep <laughs> we with this big, we need. You're, you're pretty cool. But I've already, we're already planning, uh, we'll probably stay at about three months, maybe uh, beginning of September, mid September. We're going to go home. We're going to plan a little getaway in the we're airstream planning and take, an airstream trip take a few weeks off and yeah. go on a trip finally because the only place we've really taken it is tahoe last year last year and, and we we got another trip planned next year during our recertification class that yeah. we have to go to yeah. with landstar we're gonna go to oregon i think after yeah. the class so but where we at right now we're at blue Bay, beacon yeah, getting our truck wash so Bay we Town. got when did we get a call was it wednesday or thursday it was like a, wednesday or thursday yeah one of those. agent called us with the load that we're gonna be doing this first load back it picks up tomorrow so we'll talk about it in the next clip probably tomorrow after we get it picked up it's a yeah, little yeah. little shorty run but gets us going and she did say she's working on another one so we'll see where this week takes us mosey <laughs> and uh, oh we did go check our p.o box one last time yesterday because before we always like to check it and get all of our mail before we leave out yeah, but yeah. mama crafty always checks it when we're not home oh. Is there anybody behind us? No. No, we're good. Line's moving up, so but we'll stay here until yeah. somebody gets behind us. <laughs> but we had a package in our P.O. box I wanted to open. This is from our friend Becky. She lives in Idaho, and she sent us some, like, my coffee sign I have up here. Um, she sent that, but she made masks for us and she yeah. sent us some so i figured i'd open them up and show y'all what she made us which we appreciate it so much 
I love handmade <clears throat> stuff. That's like the best, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But check it out. Let's see what she got us. <laughs> so cool. I know I told her when she was asking, I told her, make Jason a, one that's not girly. So, ooh, you'll probably like that. That's oh, awesome. Oh, wow. Those two are for you, I think. Nice. Nice. And you can uh, adjust them so I guess you can tie them to where, to yeah. what you need. Yeah. yeah. yeah that and makes then sense. she sent me these two. Awesome. So sweet. Look, it's got, look, doggies. I don't know if you can see if it'll focus, but little doggy print and the blue. Of course, my favorite color is blue. So yeah, thank you so much, Becky. Thank you, Becky. And she did, looks That's like she awesome. sent us a card, which I'll read that off camera. But yeah. thank you, Becky, so much. Yeah, we love yeah, it. Yeah. Now we'll be styling when we go into places. <laughs> Ooh, now we it looks like a medical surgeon. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. If you follow us on Instagram at the Crafty Tracker, you would have seen we went and got pedicures while we were home. Yeah. We had to wear masks there. We did. They had a <laughs> sign on the door that says, please, uh, no, no, no admit it no mass no service yeah <laughs> no <laughs> yeah yeah something like that but. yeah but i mean that's okay we're still being precautious and it was nice to get our toes done and yes it jason was. gets his done i too. did i did my feet feel so good they had so many calluses on them they mm -hmm. needed that cheese grater thing they use it, it, it was bad that's the main reason he likes it is just to get the calluses, calluses off and, get his and the massage clipped. and the, the exfoliating sand stuff they oh, use yeah and, i know i like that and the hot wax and stones yeah, yeah, and yeah, yeah, yeah. he doesn't get any color but you Every, have before you I got black before, before. <laughs> yeah yeah i did black before but uh, but yeah anyway so we figured we would jump on get the vlogs back we did do a live video last week if you didn't catch that yeah, it's yeah. a video right before this one yeah. so yeah but we will catch up with you guys tomorrow yes tell you all about this load it's not a great one but gets us back going so we're excited yes very excited cool. see what they're doing tonight it doesn't have to be so special i try to be myself you do the same and we'll be all right Start a conversation with someone Just be who I am, I care so much about first impressions oh. Happy Tuesday Happy Tuesday, we are loaded and on the road uh, Yeah, oh my gosh What a day, well let's tell you about the low first Yeah So we picked up in Texas, we're heading to Alabama It's a short run, like a little over 600 miles <laughs> One piece at 780 pounds. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, we well, started first, last night. First, starting last some night. Issues. Yeah. <laughs> first day uh, back. Yeah, first day back. <laughs> Our, we were hanging out in the back, uh, cooking dinner. I cooked up filet. Then Heather was making uh, some green beans. In the microwave. In the microwave. Then all of a sudden, the air conditioner stopped working. Everything stopped working. Not everything. Everything that runs on the generator yeah, strictly. Yeah. The inverter stuff still yeah. worked. And it was like 93 degrees. It was not cool out. It was, it was where I was sweating my butt off. And it was like 7, 8 o'clock at night. And so, like, I'm assuming, <laughs> oh, it must be one of the breakers. I jump out. I go check the breakers under the bed. I go check the breaker on the generator. None of them are tripped. And... <laughs> nothing's working so we ended up going to an rv park last night we found an rv park near the truck stop we were at yeah luckily there was one two miles away <clears throat> and we plugged up to shore power and everything worked yeah. so there is an issue with the generator <laughs> providing power to the sleeper for the high drain items like the induction cooktop uh rooftop air what are they need more treats yes they just went outside the potty yeah so i, I talked with uh patrick over at highfield it kind of because he i mean they have multiple trucks he's experienced pretty much almost everything yeah it's nice to be able to pick his brain pick his stuff. brain every once in a while and he seems to think it's the ca uh, capacitor yeah the flux capacitor the, yeah <laughs> yeah so we need to find a, a carrier deal i found one in birmingham 
uh, which is about an hour and a half from our delivery. Yeah. So we we may be heading over there after we get delivered tomorrow. There was a couple on the way to our delivery, but by the time we would get to them, they're already be closed. Yeah, today, yeah, yeah. They're so. already closed today. So. Oh my gosh! Yeah. <laughs> and then so we got picked up. We're heading yeah. down I ten because we're pretty much taking the ten half the way there. Yeah. And um. Oh my gosh, they had the freeway shut down in Louisiana. Completely shut down. Um, what, where, by Lafayette or before Lafayette? Yeah, we yeah. S we spent about two hours in about five miles of traffic. Yeah, it was ridiculous. And so yeah. we, we they when they forced us off the exit, we decided to come up, get on the one nine US 190 mm -hmm. in Louisiana, and we're gonna take that all the way across to Baton Rouge. And then back, get back Even down. Even though the GPS is telling us to go back south yeah. on the 49, I'm like, nah, we'll just keep cutting yeah, across. Yeah, because in Baton Rouge, we can cut <laughs> down, and that cuts right when the 10 turns into the 12. And, yeah, and yeah. then probably not far from there, we'll be cutting up to up, get up to the 20. the 59. Oh yeah, my gosh, so. but yeah, it's like, first day back, problems <laughs> but i am happy when we were home everything went smooth of what everything we got, did everything go smooth done, while we were home smooth. yeah yeah but so, yeah eh, and but, hey it'll make for a good video this uh capacitor oh, yeah, piece yeah. you know i'll do a video on changing it because carry uh i did call uh elw in columbus ohio they did the install mm -hmm. on the generator and i gave their uh, tech guy a call and asked so i told him i'm like hey i'm way down in louisiana it's hot pick your brain he also thinks it's the capacitor yeah. he says carriers have been having problems with the capacitors so yeah. um patrick with highfield he said they've been replacing a few so and before y'all start griping at us about buying parts because it's a brand new truck yeah it is under warranty it is but the issue is I don't how want to long sit do you want to wait. wait for them to yeah. fix it? Now, if they could get, if we go there and they're like, "Hey, we can swap it for you right now," cool. But if not, I will yeah, check first. But if they're saying, it "Oh, it's and... going to be till tomorrow until we get to you," I'm gonna be like, "Nah, I'll just buy the part." It's seventy dollar part, you yeah. know. Do I want to miss a run out for on a seventy dollar part? Right. And I'll probably buy two of them. So we have an extra. <laughs> so we have yeah. a spare because if uh, ELW is saying they're having problems with them and replacing a bunch. Might as well have a spare on hand, yeah. you know? Yeah. So. Yeah. That's the thing, you know, is just because stuff's under warranty. If it's, now, if it was like a two or $300 part, yes, we Absolutely. would definitely I went, have them. No, I'm, I'm not, not forking out that much, but no, no, for a but $70 70, part, and we might be able to get it a I'll little talk cheaper. I'll talk them down. Anytime I go to buy parts or any service or anything, any kind of maintenance, I always go in there and I'll say, yeah. well, do you guys offer a Landstar discount? Yeah. You know? Yeah. Uh, what, what's the price on? Oh, that's a lot. Can can you do any better than that? <laughs> <laughs> I always do. Hey, it works a lot of the time. It does. I usually get, I mean, you, you know, 10% off. I mean, you know they mark that stuff up. Yeah, I usually get it. Oh, gosh, it got bright. It did. The guy, so, this guy just pulled out. Yeah, let me turn it down real quick. <laughs> Man, I'm sweating. It's hot here in Louisiana. It is warm, Ooh. humid, all that. Yeah, but yeah, no we fun. wanted to let y'all know about the load and what a lovely day starting last night it was. But, you know, it's all good. We're yeah, good. Yeah. Well, let's get this fixed. And who knows? We don't have a backup load yet. I know. I think we had told you in the last clip she was working on another load, but we hadn't heard anything about it yet. So no, nothing yet. Who so. knows? We'll see. Sometimes they call in the at late. I mean, it's 3 o'clock now. So, you know, some of these places are open till 5, 6 at night. Night, so yeah. we may get a call or we'll or see. maybe not see what no, we'll see what happens yeah <laughs> we'll keep you guys posted i'm taking over right now we went a little past time when we normally switch yeah but with the traffic jam and everything it kind of messed up our time but we're still good we're still we're like yeah 526 miles from our Are drop we really that's what it says. I know. As I say, we only got like a hundred miles before we got in the traffic. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, slacker. Uh, I'm gonna be so I'll be getting us all the way there. Yeah, she'll much. be doing most of the driving. Yeah. Actually, hey, you may get us all the way there. That's what I said. I'll probably get us all the way there. Sweet. <laughs> and they have parking there, so About we'll time get you do some work first thing here. in the morning and. <laughs> Hopefully, either have a load or get that part. Yeah. I don't know. Stay yep. tuned to find out what happens. Hey, cool. <laughs> <laughs> I got a feeling that it could be great Skip all the acts, not playing games Maybe we're feeling they ring me and tell you my name Yeah, I got a feeling that it could be great Skip all the acts, not playing games No more consent and they ring me and won't be ashamed Cause I just wanna call my friends See what they're doing tonight It doesn't 
Evening. What time is it? Oh gosh! <laughs> I don't even have my phone. Uh, it's late. Nine thirty. Yeah. It is late. It is. We got delivered this morning. Yep. And then we went and got the part for the generator, the capacitor that we told you about in the last clip we did. Yeah. Seventy bucks. Seventy seventy-seven dollars. Oh yeah, exact. with tax. Yeah. It's not bad, but mm -hmm. and I tried to get a discount. They looked at me like I yeah. was stupid. <laughs> he tried to uh, see if they would get us in and cover it under warranty for them to replace it, but they wouldn't have got us until what tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. And we got a load picking up tomorrow, so, yep. so that wouldn't have worked for us. Yeah, and I mean it should be an easy part, and I think it would be a good video, you know, because yeah. of course I've been searching on the internet and there's nothing out there on how to replace this thing or where it's at or anything like that. So I think it'd be a good video. Yeah, we're gonna figure it out. We didn't do it today yeah. because by the time we got delivered and went and got that, it was actually about 60 miles away. And then we had to come 60 miles back because we're picking up where we dropped off today. But at least we have the part now and... Yeah, we'll get it changed probably after we deliver. Luckily, it's nice weather here this evening yes it's not hot yeah <laughs> or it, today it wasn't yeah. hot yeah it was like in the 70s i like as soon as we got the part and we got back to this pilot um i laid down and i, I crashed out i was yeah. tired i'd been up all night so yeah the, i definitely was not in the changing it today so good <laughs> yeah. thing good thing the weather was really permitting yes because that would have really been horrible trying to sleep in hot and, i know and we're getting into those temperatures golly yeah, yeah. It's, it's yeah it's getting into summertime it's yeah. gonna just get hotter and hotter and yep. yeah especially in the south down here i because usually it's humid here and luckily it wasn't humid it stayed around the low 70s today so yeah really nice yeah we're fortunate yeah. for us since yeah. the rooftop's not working yeah. right, right now with our yeah. that yeah. part but yeah. yeah so we're excited we got a load which we'll talk about in the next vlog not a great one but no but it's a load it's you a know load. it's yeah. like right now i think we've said in previous vlogs it can't be too too picky right now we're just you know rolling with it and oh it, gosh it, oh, I, some of our friends I, they were we hung out with them a couple weeks ago when we were in texas um and when we were at that rv park in um belton yeah and they're with panther now they drive for a fleet owner with panther and they're talking about um making a switch over to landstar and they called and the landstar told them they're not taking on any new trucks till at least september because yeah. of all the stuff that's going on yeah yeah kind of a shock yeah yeah i, mean, I guess i understand because they don't have, you know, they don't want people coming to orientations and things like that. I guess yeah. that makes sense yeah. with everything going on. Yeah. But yeah. Plus, freight's been slow anyway, so it's not like we need more drivers. True. It, more drivers just means less freight for the drivers that are here. True. And, but hopefully now that. But okay. Oh, go ahead. That, I was just gonna say, hopefully now that more places are opening up, hopefully freight will start picking up and. I wanted to mention, you know, we, we've been getting a lot of emails of people looking to make moves right now because they're not staying busy. And this is the wrong time to be making a move, yeah. you know? One um, thing to remember, just because you're slow with the carrier you're at does not mean you're going to be busier at another carrier. It's right. just the situation that's going on right, right now in the world, right, you right, know? Right, right, And freight is just... Yeah. Now, it's... when you're making a move because you've had enough of the company and like, you just need a change and all that, that's when you make a move. But making a move because it's slow right now and they're not keeping you busy and yada yada, that's that is not good yeah. business. You yeah, know, it's not absolutely. a good business move unless it's just absolutely necessary, yeah. you know, but... I mean, honestly, making a move right now, you're just, you could be digging yourself deeper in a hole, you know, so yeah. something to think about, you know, don't, don't make, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> making a move during bad times is not the, yeah, no. the grass ain't always greener. That's right. Try, That's right. try water in the grass. That's very true. Very yeah, true. Yeah. But I guess we're going to go ahead and end this one here. Stay tuned to see what our next load is going to be. 
Thank you guys as always for watching and subscribing. And until our next video. Peace, love, and expediting. The babies aren't wrestling tonight. They're not. They're tired. What are you guys doing? We're ready to lay down. Oh, look at him over oh, there. Oh, hi, baby. <laughs> <laughs> he is such a snuggler. Snuggle bug. Hey. Hey. You ready to lay down and get comfy? Huh? You ready to lay down and get comfy? <laughs>